I'm Tiffany Jolly. This is Omnia Yoga. Jump on the mat. Let's do this thing. I want you to start with your feet hip bone distance apart. Ground your energy down. Flex the quads. Tuck the tail. Pull your belly button in. Tuck the lower ribs. Open the heart. Mountain pose. Inhale. Exhale down. Inhale. Exhale. Keep your core tight. Belly button stays pulling in. Inhale. Good. Exhale down. Hands on your hips. Bend your knees. Figure eights. Figure eights. Figure eights. Good. Warming up the hip, those hips. This is where your creativity lives, your passion, your pleasure center. This is also where we store a lot of our emotions. So as we start to move through those hips, we start to work through some of our emotional baggage. We start to let go. We start to release so that we can get closer to the truth of who we are. Inhale, arms up. Keep your arms up. This is called Sapana Mudra. Two pointer fingers together. Left thumb on top for ladies. Right thumb on top for fellas. Letting go of negativity. Good. Hold. Swan dive. Four folds. Gorgeous. If your hamstrings are really tight, bend the knees, no big deal. Walk it out. Let's go. Keep those shoulder blades pulling up. Neck long. Keep pressing back. Always a baby bend in the joint. Perfect. Walk those feet all the way together. Shoot those arms up to your pose. Arms by your ears. Pull your belly button and lengthen through the spine. Pulse. You're doing awesome. Stay with me. You got this. Good. I want you to hold. We're going to throw. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Letting go of whatever it is you need to let go of. Exhale. Inhale. Really breathe. Breathing is so cleansing. Two more. One more. Forward fold, hold. Gorgeous. Heel to walk those feet out. I want them about mat distance apart. Point the toes out slightly. Bend your knees. Round it up. Open your heart. Exhale. Bend your knees. Half circle. Arms out. Good. Again, working through those hips. Pull your belly button in. Arms up. Good. Fold. Walk those toes out. Pull the shoulder blades up. Shoot the tail to the sky. Hands can be on your hips or on the floor. Baby bend in the knees. Plant those hands to the floor. Baby pulse. Breathe into the letting go. Your hamstrings represent letting go. Probably why we all have such tight hamstrings. Letting go is a challenge, I know. Good. Walk your feet nice and wide here. We're still warming up, so go gentle, but keep your spine long. Press it. Left to right, go. Yes. Breathe. You got this. You're doing awesome. Listen to your body. Yoga meets you where you are at on your journey. It's not about being perfect on the first time. It's about showing up on your mat, doing the work, getting stronger, Rising up. Yes. Walk those feet in. Just a little bit wider than that distance. Bend your knees. Hands on your thighs. Round it up. Let's go. Good. Hold it down. Give me shoulders. Ready? Pull your belly button in. Hold, round it up. Inhale, arms up. You're gonna exhale down in the goddess pose. Open those fingers really wide, energetic. Point the toes out. Tuck the tail. Yes. Beautiful pose to help you feel safe, secure, strong for chakra. Pulse, pulse, pulse. Yes, hold. Arms long. Let's take it over. Here we go. Reach little pose. Oh, hello, side body. Waking up. Through that rib cage. Strong to the legs. We want that nice solid foundation as we flow. Just like life. 
You don't want to build your house on sand. We need a strong and solid foundation as we flow through life. We don't want to fight life. We don't want to swim upstream. We want to flow, yeah? We want to be in alignment. This is what this is all about. Good. Hold. Turn your toes. Hands on your hips. Hold. Oh, yes. Let's go through some spirals here. Watch your around. Good. On the away. So good. Hold it. Plank it. Down dog. Tail to the sky. Spread your fingers wide. Weight towards your heels. Pedal back. Good. You look amazing. Don't give up on me. Hold. I want you to wag your tail. It's little. We're just loosening up the low back. Hold. Drop to your knees. We're going to go through a child's pose flow. Ready? Here we go. It's lift, buns up. Down, sit back. Child's pose flow. Good. Anytime we're taking it into child's pose, we're surrendering. We're letting go. Whatever feels too heavy, we're laying it on the mat, handing it over to our higher power, whether that be God, spirit, universe, whatever word works for you. You are not alone. You are supported. Yes. Yoo! Nice. Pull. Down dog. Inhale. Right leg rises up. You can do a dancer leg or a yogi leg. Dancer leg. That hip opens. Toe is pointed to the sky. Pulse it up. Pull your belly in. Gorgeous. Step it through. Runner's lunge. Lengthen through the upper back. Pulse it out. Let's go. Good. I want you to lift through the back of your left knee. Spine is long. You got this. You look amazing. You're not going to give up on me, okay? Hold. I want you to ground down your left arm. Make sure this hip is in alignment, not poking out. Slowly <laughs> start to twist and rise. I inhale my hair. Pull your shoulder blades down your back. Reach up for the stars. Pulse. Baby. Baby. Good. Hold. Take a breath. Set it down. We're going to work through that front leg. Go for extension. Ready? Here we go. Yes. Always keep a baby bend in the joints. Never a full lockout. Breathing through those hips. So you got it. We're working through stress release. We're working through letting go of any stuck or stagnant emotions. We store our issues in our tissues. We often repress and hold on to stuff all the way back from childhood at times. So as we do our flow, we start to let go. Holding, drop your back knee for me. Slowly walk yourself up. Good, I want you to come all the way back so we can make sure we have good form. Square your hips, tuck the tail. Really activate those low abs. I want you to sweep your arms up and reach for the stars. And I want you to slowly come into this. Keep your core tight. You look awesome. Give me a baby pulse. I love this song. It's gonna get fun. Just wait. Hold. Down. Oh. Tuck your back toes. Good. I want you to float that foot back. Give me a down dog. Gorgeous. Hopper step to Malasana. Low yoga squat. Hands to your heart. Roll it up. Good. Keep those knees pulling open. This is such a beautiful pose to let go of anxiety, depression. If you're feeling like your world is shaky, this is your jam right now, okay? Yeah. Good. I want you to hold center, hands to heart. We're going to go through kundalini squats. You got this. Arms up. Here we go. All the way up. All the way down. Now, if your knees are like, oh, heck no. Stop at 90 degrees. You can stop right there, yeah? If you need to. So I've been talking about those chakras, right? Your chakras are your seven main energy centers. 
They all represent different things. They're connected to different organs, different elements. It is said that the health of the chakra is so important to total well-being. So you want to know about it. It's important. Hold down. Woo! Plant your hands. Plant. Down dog. Pedal back. Let's go. So that move we were just doing is all about moving energy up. Pull. Cleansing the chakra. Energy starts at that root chakra and moves up. As we do that pumping motion, it helps to clear and cleanse any stuck or stagnant energy. Inhale, left leg rise. Step it through. Runner's lunge. Good. Lengthen through the spine. Front knee at 90. Lift up to the back of your right knee. Breathe into that right hip flexor. We hold so much stress there. Pulse. This is going to help you walk off the mat feeling blissful, feeling amazing, feeling like you just shed a ton of emotional weight. Mm, yeah. Yeah. Woo! Hold it. Ground down. Twist it out. Pull the shoulder blades down the back. Look up. Square the hip. Pulse. Let's go. All the three. Gorgeous. Set it down. We're going through that front leg. Ready? Keep flowing. Keep flowing. Last three. Two. Oh man, it's hard for me to do 15 minutes. Drop down. I have so much awesome stuff I want to show you. Come back. Square the hips. Tuck the tail. Sweep. Exhale. Good. Open the heart. Oh, hello, hip flexor. Nice and gentle. Give me a baby pulse. So we can match up what we did on the other side. Hold. Down. Good. Take it through. Whoop. Down, down. Inhale, right leg rises again. Exhale into pigeon. Good, knee outside of the hip. Square the hips, open the arms, flow just a couple times. Through that omnia wave. And then take it all the way down. Or you can stay on your elbows, that's cool too. So I want you to really breathe into that outer thigh and hip again. Beautiful pose for that emotional release, for letting go, surrender to this pose. Do the best that you can to stay with your body, to stay with the discomfort in that outer thigh and hip. You shouldn't be forcing it, but I do want you to stay with your body and stay with the stretch, allowing you to face challenges head on in your life. Everything that you do in Omnia is going to translate into your everyday life. So do the best that you can to stay right here, right now, in this moment with your body with your breath, with this uncomfortable, emotional pose. Just breathe. Beautiful job. Walk those hands up. Tuck the back toes. Really engage through the core. Lift. Set that leg down. Inhale, left leg rises up to the sky. You can do a dancer leg or yoga leg. Take it through to pigeon. Open those arms wide and flow. Just a couple times. And then set it down. Breathe into your pigeon. Relax the shoulders. Focus on the sensation that you have on that outer thigh and hip. and 
gentle walk yourself up. Plant those hands, tuck the back toes. Down dog. Take a moment here and breathe. Look towards the top of your mat, hop or step to seated. Good, we're gonna unwind and take it into Shavasana. Rolling yourself back. Let those legs be open wide. Let those palms be open. Let everything surrender. No more flexing. I'm so glad that you joined me. If you want more Omnia Yoga, you can find it on tiffanyjolly.com. Let's take a big inhale up. Exhale down. Good. Sweep it up. Inhale. Exhale down. Let's do that one more time to close our practice. Inhale. Namaste. You're amazing. And I'll see you in the Omni Yoga Tribe. Bye.